Hey, hey, you guys. Just got out of my math class, the only Zoom class that I have for the semester. Just got out of it. It's 12.15 right now. We actually ended math class early today for once, which is great. But yeah, today is Monday, and I want to start the week off really good, really good. Like, let's get some things done um, before I have to work again, and then I just fall off the edge of the earth because of work. But, um, okay. I look rusty, crusty, and dusty. For one, I'm really upset because I really wanted my hair to be done. Um, but I was just having some issues with the coloring. I didn't really know how to do it. And finally was able to do it. Like, kind of get the color that I wanted. But, whoops. But yesterday, I went to Sally's to try and get, like, a cap. And it, they, like, were out of stock of so many things. Because they apparently didn't get their shipment or something like that. And so I was just so annoyed and I didn't even go to another beauty supply store. I was just like, whatever. Later today, gonna get a cap. Hopefully my hair gets done tonight. And then you'll see me in my new hairstyle because uh, what is this? Oh my gosh, you guys. So I'm not sure if my, my natural hair care video will be up before this video or after this video or not. But you guys, oh my gosh, my hair, it feels so sweet soft it's like crazy I feel like my hair has never been this soft before I don't know if it's because of the new product I was using or if it's because I put um, oil in my hair and then I rinsed it out but like oh my gosh it feels so amazing like silk like it's just melting in my hands I don't know I don't know but it feels real good so if you haven't seen that video go ahead and watch it also you guys literally like we are growing so fast. If you've been watching me for a hot sec, you know that my goal at the end of the summer was to hit 500 subscribers. But my feminine hygiene video kind of blew up and a bunch of people have been subscribing. And I think I'm at like 430 subscribers right now. It might change depending on when this video goes up. But I think today I'm at like 430 subscribers. And it's not even summer. It's not the end of summer at all. So I have to get a new goal. Um, I don't know what that goal is going to be yet, but I'm super close to the 500 goal already. So that's freaking crazy because that was like my goal for the end of the summer. But I want to thank everyone that has been subscribing and welcome to this little community that I'm starting to build up. So yeah, it's just super exciting. I don't know. Like, I don't want to jump ahead already. Well, first, let me hit the 500, my actual goal and then I'll make another goal because I don't want to like jump ahead and then like you know get all mixed up and things like that but yeah so we're gonna try and have a productive day need to do some things need to do homework oh I actually need to edit a video because I didn't post this weekend I'm thinking about changing my posting schedule from Saturdays to like Sundays and Wednesdays so I think I'm gonna do that but I'm not sure yet but we're gonna find out. I actually really do need to edit this video because I didn't post this weekend because I was just so busy and tired from work. So edit this video, post it on Wednesday, edit another video, upload on Sunday. So we're gonna get it all done today. You guys know me, I'm already starting to cook for the day. Um, cause last week I, um, last week, <laughs> Christmas tree. <laughs> last week um if you don't know the joke by now like watch the other videos like seriously <laughs> but um yeah so what was i saying oh last week i made um some stew and i ate it all this week because i've been eating really good in april and um so yeah i'm gonna try and like do that like cook something big enough for on Monday so that for the week I have something to eat instead of like cooking something each day just so that like because sometimes you're busy and like you don't feel like cooking and cooking can honestly be like an all-day thing sometimes so just do that like so with the stew um, it was really versatile actually because like you can cook the stew and then you can like cook rice on the side or like you can cook beans on the side or like spaghetti um, butter pasta things like that and then just eat it every single day month uh each day 
I'm actually almost done with it. Today's gonna be the last day I eat it because it's like literally almost gone. And like today I am making, hold on, let me show you. So right now I am cooking some, ooh, this is hot. I'm cooking some chickpeas. So right now I'm boiling some of them, but then I'm gonna um, roast some of them in um, a pan with just oil in it so that I can have some chickpea like uh, quesadillas or a taco even and then in this one I'm cooking some pinto beans that needs some more water in here because they are not soft yet cooking some pinto beans and then in the oven turn the light in the oven I have some Brussels sprouts cauliflower and then I'm making some kale chips so yeah, preparing for the week on what I'm going to eat. Gotta do that if I'm gonna try and be healthy. I'm actually really proud of myself because I have been super healthy. Oh, I have a pimple. <sighs> I've been trying to be super healthy um, all of April and it's paid off, so I'm really happy about that. Gonna continue this healthy eating journey. Hopefully I can start incorporating working out again. Excuse me. And yeah, just getting back to my healthy lifestyle that I used to live. Let's get into editing this video because class has been over for a hot sec now. Not really, I think only five minutes. So editing this video. Oh, you guys. So I am getting rid of Adobe um, because for one, when I got Adobe, well, you know what, let's back it up really quick. I never wanted to pay for an editing software anyways because when I used to have enough storage on my phone, I would use iMovie, but um, I have limited storage on my phone, so I always have to offload apps, delete a bunch of apps, delete a bunch of pictures and things like that, so I had to stop using iMovie, and so I started using Adobe Premiere Pro because, um, you know, I was in college, or ball state it was free to use and so I was using that but then when the pandemic hit for some reason it wouldn't let me go on to Adobe for free anymore so I got the um, paid version and for the students which was like 2186 or something like that and I thought cuz I was a student that that was gonna last forever but um <laughs> no I was wrong Last month, I was charged $31.86, and I was like, hold on a second, wait a second. Why am I being charged like the full price of all of these apps now? So I'm like trying to do my research, like why am I getting paid, got paid, t uh, why was $10 taken out of my account, 10 extra dollars? So that student discount only last a year so apparently I've been using the Adobe thing the paid student version for a year and after your year is up you're done and you start paying the real version and I was like oh no no I'm not paying 10 extra more dollars for like something that I don't know I use it but like no no if I can get something for free I'm gonna use it for free so I've been trying to use DaVinci DaVinci Resolve I'm actually really mad because when I was trying to figure out if I was going to get Adobe, um, I actually was using, well, I didn't use it. I was looking at DaVinci Resolve and um, I guess I, because I had already learned everything for Adobe, I was just like, whatever, I'm not going to learn DaVinci, learn something new. And I just didn't want to learn a new software. So that's why I stuck with Premiere Pro, but I'm beating myself in the butt right now because... I wish I would have just learned DaVinci because it's actually really not even that hard. It's free. Um, there's a free and a paid version. I wish I would have honestly just did the paid version of DaVinci when I was doing that because if you do the math, $21 in a year is like $200 and the DaVinci version is almost $300. So it would have just, and it's a one-time payment so that would have been a better option than Adobe but you know you live from your mistakes and all that so I'm working with not working with but I'm using DaVinci Resolve now to edit this video and then once I figure out once I make sure that everything that I need to edit this video is accurate and like up to my standards then I am done with Adobe because they're on games they are on games for real 
So, yeah. But yeah, let's start editing. editing but with editing is a process okay because oh this lighting's really bad editing is a process and just like my phone I don't have that much storage on my computer so what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get another one of these because this is a terabyte and a terabyte has a lot of storage I think almost like a thousand mps or something like that and I've been saving all of my videos on here. It's been great. It's been simple. But I think I need another one for when I have to download my clips onto my computer because it's taking up so much storage that this video is taking a lot longer to edit because my computer keeps freezing and it's really annoying and it's just hurting my editing process. And then because my computer keeps freezing, DaVinci, which I have to download onto my hard drive, keeps freezing up so uh, yeah it's really annoying so I think I'm gonna get one of these I think they're like $25 but it's honestly worth it so that you don't have to go through this process and make your editing process just a lot longer you know it'll probably take me a hot sec to edit this video anyways so hopefully when I talk to you guys again me and Trina are gonna be in the car headed to the beauty salon so that I can get a cap so that my hair gets done, okay? Oh, actually, speaking of my hair, I should show you how my hair looks now because I kind of stopped showing the process because I was just getting mad and angry, but it looks better now. Not the exact color that I wanted, but it looks better. Let me just show you. Okay, so this is what it looks like. You guys know the type of look I was going for, so um, I'm gonna do like the type of look I was going so for so that's why only like the top right here is um colored but y'all oh I'm glad this wasn't my actual hair because let me tell you my hair would be fried right now I struggled so much just trying to get this color it's not even like the exact color I was doing a video and I was kind of showing the process of how I did this but um it was not coming out the right color like at all i've dyed this like three different times for over an hour it was a lot of work and it's it's better now because how it looked before it was like a orangey red color and because the hair is black it was looking like halloween it was so so bad but now it's kind of like a strawberry blonde a little bit as you can see some of the strands aren't like the same color because i dyed it so much but like if i would have kept it on longer like at the top everything would have been fine in the same color like see like this strand right here is a lot more blonde than right here see like that's still kind of like the orangey color but i was kind of like going for this color right here it's so pretty but um you know I'm just working with what I got I know for next time how to do this so if I do ever want to try and color her hair again like I know what to do but um I can't wait to install it though but I just wish everything was the same color but it looks good because it was a, it was a lot worse before it was a lot worse before so um, yeah, I'm going to do a review on this hair because it actually held up pretty good 
even though like I dyed it a lot. So it was it was a lot, but yeah. Me and Chanel are finally on our way. We finally got out. It's such a nice day actually. It's really beautiful. It's a nice is this still considered spring, Chanel? Yeah. Okay, well, this nice spring day, it's been cold like the last couple of days, but it's finally nice again. So we're on our way to the beauty supply store. This was the original beauty supply store that we were supposed to go to, but that we didn't go to. So we're on our way there, and hopefully they have everything that I need. And yeah, we're almost there. Auntie Annie's. We we went to the beauty supply store and got our stuff, but today was free pretzel day at Auntie Annie's. So you were able to get a salted pretzel, a non-salted pretzel, or the cinnamon sugar one, and we got the salted pretzel. And yeah, we got a free pretzel, and it's gonna be like our first time trying just like their regular pretzel because we always get like the pretzel hot dog things, but never like anything else. Oh. But I, <laughs> but me and Chanel were saying, you want to try it first? I just want to rip off the piece. Okay. Well, me and Chino were saying that oh I because it's soft. Yeah, it's soft. It smells really you good. Know, the and one with the is like hard. Yeah. Cause we're oh going my gosh! Edit that out. They don't even know what high school I go to. She act like I don't know how. It needs a hot dog. There's a lot of butter. <laughs> Chino, you don't you understand. That would be what else thought too. I'm mm -hmm. I don't I'm, understand what. I'm literally scarred from eating pretzels like this from daycare. Remember when we used to have those days and we would eat those like pretzel oh, things? Too much salt. Too much salt? We shouldn't have asked for the salt on it. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Mm. Yeah, it is a lot. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> eat some water. Next time we should do no salt, but like when I was at the one from my high school when I go to football games, too much. It'd be too hard and I'm like no yeah. salt. It's really good. But yeah, I'm scarred for pretzels because of daycare. More? Mm -hmm. I wish we could get a dipping sauce. Yeah, they didn't say a dipping sauce for free. Not that I like sauces anymore. Okay, that's it. This one's really good. It didn't taste like a pretzel either, mm -hmm. which I like. Yeah, I'm still in the process of editing my video. Okay, but am I about to finish it? I have a lot of stuff in my mouth. But. <laughs> Hold on, I tasted daycare for a second. <laughs> okay, well, I think we're about to go to Target really quick. 